Hey everyone, welcome back to the Clinch River Homestead. I'm John. I'm Nicole. Today, we thought it would be a great idea if we took you up to the front of the property where we're going to be building the house at. Oh, and if you're wondering what all these things flying around us right now, those are the uh, Asian lady beetles. So they are not ladybugs and they do bite. Watch out for them. Anyway, come on with us up to the property. These things are getting me, Asian lady beetles. We also brought Nala with us. She loves it here. John's setting up the drone to fly so we can see from above. got done with the drone some drone shots okay so we're up here at the property we're gonna start from I guess the right hand side to the left hand side towards the main road so that uh, we can show you what's going where so let's walk over here and we'll show you where the garage is gonna be put so they've already started putting some mounds of dirt here but in this general vicinity is where the garage will be going hopefully now this big monstrosity, this is going, uh, they're going to be taking this thing down. It's just going to be too close to the house, even though I think it's kind of a cool looking tree. Right where all this rubble pile is right here is right where the house is going to go. And then there's going to be a U-shaped driveway coming in from both sides here. So this way we can get to it from this side. And if we got trailers, then they can make the turn all the way around. So that'll be pretty cool. Now the dump truck people were out here and dumped a couple loads of dirt. Now as you could tell from the aerial shots, that we've got like several piles of rubble that are out here. Let me show you what the geniuses over at the dumping company thought they would do. Welp, there you go folks pile of rubble that's got to get thrown in dumpsters. Dirt has now been piled on top of the pile of rubble. So now that just makes more work for the next guy coming in because they got to throw everything away. So anyway, let's move on. Okay, so over here we're close to the road now. 
And the house is probably going to end somewhere right over in here. So now you can see the road right behind me here. And the driveway entrance is going to be right here and horseshoe all the way around to the other side. For this side, we thought it would be really cool if we did high tunnels over here. As, as you can tell, maybe you can't, but the sun is really bright in this area of the property. So uh, we thought we would put up either a 30 by 90 or a 30 by 72 green uh, high tunnel here. And maybe two of them side by side or we'll see how much we can get long ways. But we kind of got to keep it up here. Anyway, then of course we do want to have chickens near where the garden is. So we'll probably put a chicken coop somewhere around over here as well. Maybe, maybe down back this area right behind me looks pretty good for a chicken coop. I don't know. So it all depends on the house placement. So anyway, I thought we would show everybody where we're going to be putting the house. So this way you kind of have an idea. This is the beginning. Yep. So follow the along beginning. on our journey. All right, so we got to get out of here because these uh, lady beetles are all over the place and they're like in our clothes and down my shirt. So we got to get home. So we'll catch everybody on the next time. I want to thank everybody for joining us here on the Clinch River Homestead. If you haven't done so already, go down below, hit that subscribe and tick that little bell. Don't cost you anything. And if you like the video today, make sure you smash on that thumbs up button. It really helps that YouTube algorithm. In any case, we'll see everybody on the next one. Thanks for joining us. Bye.